Greetings and welcome once again to all the people taking the time to watch this video and follow this channel. It's I, the A-Fall Champ, the Adult Fan a Lego Champion, here with another, we can call it a set review. It's a collectible minifigure, so who knows uh, if we want to call that a set or not. It is set 7, 10, 29, the Centaur Warrior. Of course, that shouldn't surprise anyone that could read the title of this YouTube video. So uh, looking at the figure, just real quick, give it a good spin there, take the hair off, show you the alternate face that hopefully kind of focus a little better. There we go. I still feel like that's not focusing very well. Man, there we go. You gotta see, gotta see those freckles there. Oh my goodness. So anyway, with this figure, again, there's nothing, anything particularly, oh, why am I struggling with this so, so much? Oh, and of course, and so then I knock off the, the quiver. There we go, there we go, there we go. The hair's still not on there right, but there we go. So there's nothing really wrong with this figure per se. I just thought, I don't know, uh, I just, I expected more, I guess, out of a collectible minifigure. Uh, I really like that pr that torso print. I think the accessories are nice, the bow and arrow, and the red apple. The red apple is a whole other Lego thing for me. I don't understand why Lego insists on making so many green apples. Green apples are the majority in Lego cities, but they are not the majority in real world. I guess maybe that's, I'm expecting real world to mimic the lego or vice versa i guess but anyway uh clearly this is one with the with the uh with the body that you can uh the horse body that you can feel through the packaging i mean that's one of the easiest ones that and the paddle surfer with the dolphin that uh it's very easy to feel through the bag i mean it's nice and thick there but uh, I don't know why I went with this, like, forest look to it. You would think that it would be, with the being a centaur, that it would be, like, uh, ancient Greek, if I'm mem remembering my mythology correctly. It's clearly not. Again, I don't, it doesn't have to be that way, but that's what I would have expected. Uh, again, nothing super wrong with it. I just, there doesn't seem to be anything super great about it either. So, um... I guess I'm giving it maybe like a C plus or a B minus just based on the fact that, uh, I mean, it's different. There's nothing wrong with it, but there also doesn't seem to be anything great with it. And to have a, to have a, a higher score, I would think I would have to say how good it was at something. And I just can't necessarily come up with something that's super, super great about it. So uh, leave me a comment. Tell me if you agree, if you disagree, if you think I'm being overly harsh, if you think that I'm being overly generous with the grade, leave me a comment, hit the like button if you like the video, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more of them in the future, or at least get alerts when I when I post them. Uh, thanks for watching this far. Hopefully I hear from you soon. Hopefully you hear from me again soon. And as always, thanks for watching.